So you took yeah. a year off, and then where the hell oh, does man. fighting come? But you, <laughs> did you always want to fight MMA? Uh, bro, I always got into fights, bro. I've been fighting my entire life. Like, I'm talking like one-on-ones, one-on-fours, one-on-eight, one-on-twelve. Like, one-on-twelve? What are you fighting in Russia? 12, Jesus uh, Christ. I fought 12 people by myself before. Like, just situations, shit happens. You know what I mean? And then, you know, next thing you know, you you just fighting. You know what I mean? I'm yep. just reacting. And so, and was anybody like, damn, the mom's pretty good at fighting. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah, Your mom I mean, in fourth grade when you knocked I mean, out that It's kind of hard. Grader. It's kind of hard to deny. You know what I mean? We get into a fight and all of a sudden there's a bunch of people sleeping. Yeah, knocked out you and you're saying? good. Yeah. 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 Your heart rate's lot. not up. I yeah. Knocked a lot of people out. Yeah, I bet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're going to get sweet dreams. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So you just started starting dudes growing up and then you're just like, ah, you, you watched a UFC fight or what? Mm. How, what got you? down the UFC path? Because there's always like a fight or maybe it's an ultimate fight or something got people hooked on it. So I was at B-Dubs and I actually saw the Anderson Silva fight. I was amazed, you know what I mean? It was like, He's like a freak. For something, for something like, like it was, you know I mean? That was like one of the most eye-catching Nuts. performances like I think of all time. I agree. You know, um, so I was like, damn, so those people out here that's really like that, what if I run into that guy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What if yeah. I run into that guy? So I need to become that guy. Yeah. You know, and uh, that kind of sparked the interest. And then, um, like, I got, I had to, like, growing up, you know, like, my like my group, the, the core group of guys that I was around, we, we're brothers, you know what I mean? So it was like, like my god brothers, you know. Um, one of them actually did MMA. He came over to my brother's house and he showed us his fight, like, on YouTube. I'm like, oh, yeah. like I'm thinking, man, like, this is fucking dope. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, he actually had the fight. He actually went in there and did it. I was like, I want to get in there and do it. I want to do it like the other dude did. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I went I went into the gym and uh, never left. That's where I met my head coach now. To this day? Yeah. Holy shit, coach, that's my right. My head coach, all my coaches, they, they were at, they, at that gym. Damn. Yeah, you're a humble ass dude. Most guys get big and like see and they go to these mega gyms, you know? And you're just doing the damn thing. Well, that like, kid in fourth grade you knocked out still cool? He's your best friend back then? That's fam. That's he's fam. still fam. That's family, yeah. He's pissed we're talking about it. No, nah, not at damn. all, man. He laughs about it all the time. You're Shout good. out Andrew. Andrew Ogden. So What's his name? Andrew Ogden. Andrew what? Andrew. Andrew, Andrew Ogden. A Andrew Ogden. What up, yeah. dude? Um, sorry about that concussion. Sorry to hit you back in the day. <laughs>